Hey friends, I am excited because today we are gonna do our melting snowballs experiment. But the first thing we need to do is go get some snow. So I've got my bowl here. Let's go outside and get some snow. In my backyard and it is cold out here. A lot of the snow has melted, but there's still a little bit left. Let's see if we can find some. All right, here's some snow. I'm gonna see if I can get some in my bowl. Oof, I'm back inside, that was cold. So I've got enough snow. Now, if you don't have enough snow in your backyard, you might have to go on a little field trip to either a neighbor's yard or to a park to see if you can find enough snow because a lot of it's already melted. But I've got my snow here and then we're gonna make it into two snowballs. Here's my bowl of snow. What do you think is gonna happen to all this snow now that we've brought it inside? If you have a guess, then mommy or daddy or a special grown-up at home can help you write that down. It says, what will happen to the snowballs when we bring them inside? Hmm, I wonder. Well, we are gonna make two snowballs. I'm gonna get some snow out. Make my first snowball. Pack it as tight as I can. I want it to be about the size of a tennis ball. If you're not sure how big that is, and your grown up at home can help you. So I've got one there, and I'm gonna make another one. And I wanna make it as close to the same size as I can. What about that? Are those the same size? No, this one's too small. I need to make it bigger. Let's see. I think it's getting closer, a little bit more be about the same size. Those look pretty good. They're not exactly the same, but they're pretty close. So as long as you get them as close as you can. Now I'm gonna get my cups. So you have two cups from your bag. I'm gonna put one in this cup and one in the other cup. And we're gonna put one cup on the counter. We're just gonna leave it out and then we're gonna put one in the fridge. Let's bring this one upstairs to the fridge. Okay, I've got my two cups here. One I'm gonna leave right here on the counter. And then I'm gonna put this one in the fridge. And then we're gonna come back and check on it in about 30 minutes. So your grown up who's helping you can set the timer. And in 30 minutes, we're gonna see what happened. Do you have a guess? On your sheet, you can guess it says, I think the snowball on the counter is going to melt. Do you think it'll melt fast or medium or will it melt slow? And then what about the one in the fridge? What's going to happen to that one? You can circle what you think is going to happen. And then when we come back and check on it, you can draw a little picture of what's happening inside your cup. Does it look the same as it does now or has anything changed? Hey friends, so I've been checking on my cups after every hour and I've been observing what's happening. So observe means to watch and look really carefully and closely. And it's been really cool to see what's been happening. So you can do that three times every hour for three hours. You can check your cups and see what's happening. And then if you want to draw a picture of it, you can. So I'm not going to tell you what happened to mine because I want to see what happens with your cups. I can't wait to hear about it. All right, friends, have fun.